ones. <laughs> sing all the great 
arias. They were cut, they were bastardized, they, uh, uh, because it was vaudeville, of course, so you didn't get the long recitatives and stuff like that. That's right. Yeah, and so I would you know, belt out my arias, and, and, and when I had to, I would stand on a beer crate beside my stepfather because we couldn't reach the microphone together otherwise. <laughs> no lavaliers in those days. How old were you when you were presented to the Queen? Um, the first time, um, I was 10 years old. And uh, I write in the book uh, that my parents pulled me out of school one day. I did go to school for two years, I, apart from that. I went to various schools because I was always traveling, but I did have a nice school for two wonderful years. And uh, they pulled me out of school one day because they said we're going to do a concert in London. Somewhat short notice, and I was surprised. And I dashed home early and got into my party dress, and we drove up to London. And that my father, my stepfather, was about to park the car, and uh, a wonderful liveried gentleman came over and said, "Terribly sorry, sir, can't park here. This is where the Queen's car is going to be." <laughs> and my father said, "Oh, fine, we'll, we'll buzz off." And so I said, "Did they say the Queen's car?" And my mother said, "No, no. He said the Green's car." <laughs> <laughs> Thank God, I can do something to help. Um, the 